Welcome ladies and gentlemen, how's it going guys, it's TK here and today I'm going to be bringing you guys a little bit of a tutorial and today I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can get the best out of your Asteroid 40 mic quality. Uh, this is the mic quality that I get from when I used Asteroid 40, so that's the voice you're listening to right now, it's from the Asteroid 40 headset itself. So that's kind of cool, so if you guys like this, you know, uh, like this quality, then this is the video for you. So uh, let's get straight into it, let's waste some more time. Alright, so first off, what you want to do, you pretty much just want to do like the normal stuff. Uh, you've probably seen a video like this, but I'm pretty much putting it all together into one. Uh, you want to go to the, you want to go to your your internet browser, and you want to go to www.astrogaming.com slash firmware. I'll leave a link down in the description, uh, which is the first link down in the description for you guys to use. And then uh, after that, what you want to do is you want to go down to the uh, Mixamp Pro firmware. And uh, if you have PC or Mac, then just download whichever one you're on. So that's kind of, that's you know, really easy to use, uh, so pretty much just do that and you're good to go, so just download that and you should be good to go, uh, and then after that, uh, you want to go down to your speakers, so right here where your speakers are, you want to you want to right click on it and go to recording devices, click on that, uh, click on the mic that you want to use, then go down to properties, go to levels, and then right here is where everything's going to change, so if I slowly, uh, this is pretty much makes your mic quality, the mic quality for the Asteroid 40s, so um, if I slowly put this up, you guys will start to hear me start to get a little bit crackling or start to get a little bit loud, so I'm sorry for that, guys. But, you know, as you guys can see, it gets very, very bad. And what you want to do is you just want to put it all the way back down. And I like to put it at 35. 35 is good for me, so I like to put it around there. Um, so that's it's very, very fun and easy to use on that, so I'm sorry about blowing your ears out there for a second. But, you know, uh, you can also go to, if you use Audacity for your gameplay commentary type of thing, um, you can easily just change it from here as well. So, you know, you can just change it here. Um, as well, so that, that's around 35 as well. So 0 0.3 between 0 0.4, that's around that's around my 35 35 mark. And then, you know, as you guys can see, you know, this thing will move right here, so it will move a little bit uh, because you moved it. As you guys can see, you know, since you moved it in um, Audacity, it will move there as well. So it's just very very um, easy for you guys to use if you guys want to do it that way. And also, guys, if you guys finding out that your voice is a little bit low, um, what you can do is you can easily just change it. Uh, if you guys use Sony Vegas, you can easily just, you know, uh, download that. And um, pretty much you can easily just, you know, turn down the voice volume. If, you, if your voice volume is a little bit low, or you can turn it all the way up if your voice is, you know, uh, if, you want to, if you want to turn your voice up. So pretty much that's pretty easy for this tutorial, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you guys found it helpful, make sure to smash the like button. That would be absolutely awesome. And subscribe to my channel if you guys are new. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.